guys, today I'm going to be doing a little bit of a different video. I've never really done anything like this before, but I wanted to try it out and I figured it'd be cool because we're going to be talking about a very inexpensive mask and I love drugstore stuff and this one I've actually never tried before, so I wanted to get on here, try it out with y'all and see how it works. Drinking my morning coffee. Ugh. Mmm, coffee is so good. Can you tell how gloomy it is outside? I feel like it's very dark in here. Do you like my coffee mug? I got it last season in my um my winter FabFitFun box. I don't know where it's from. I have no idea who it's from, but I got it in my FabFitFun box. So I know if you go on their website, they'll probably have like past boxes, you know, and it'll tell you where it's from. I'll leave it down below. I'll do that for you. All right, so this brand of mask that we're going to be trying today, I love this brand, and I've only ever tried them a few times. But when I first moved back to America, I found these masks first in Publix in South Carolina. But now I live in Oklahoma, if you did not know. Hi, hello, I'm Tyler. So I've been here in Oklahoma for three to four years now, and I've only ever seen this brand of masks in Publix before. And apparently Publix is only an Eastern thing, so <laughs> I was kind of screwed. And I felt really sad because I... Ugh, I love those masks, and I couldn't find them anywhere. But if y'all have been seeing my recent Ulta hauls, I've been on Ulta a lot lately, and I found the brand again. I found them on Ulta, which makes me so excited because we don't have Publix here. We don't have anything like that here. Kind of like how H-E-B is only a Texas thing. So, I'm so excited and happy that I found them on Ulta. And, for the big reveal, it is this one. The brand is Freeman Feeling Beautiful, and the mask we're going to be trying today is a Renewing Cucumber Peel-Off Gel Mask. And it instantly refreshes and clarifies for rejuvenated skin. And guys, I have like 12, 10, around there, 10 of these different masks. Like, not 10 of this one, but 10 of this brand of masks, you know what I mean? So if y'all want me to try out other cheap masks, because these are only like $7, I believe, I'm pretty sure. They're less than $10, I know that for a fact, but, and out of all the ones I have, I do only not like one. I mean, I haven't tried all of them yet, but I only don't like one, but that's because it was some oil-absorbing bullshit, and if, uh, if you know me, I have extremely dry skin, so I don't know what I was thinking picking up that one. And they're really cheap, so I'm very happy with this brand so far, and I love them. So I wanted to try this out today, see how it works. I've never done a peeling mask, and I'm kind of nervous, and I hope it does something for me. If it does nothing... I'm hoping at least it'll remove some baby hairs or that peach fuzz, you know what I mean? And it says it's just a 10 to 15 minute mask, so here we go. My face is cleansed, so we're good on that front. Actually, before we start, I think I'm going to put on a hoodie because I'm cold, okay? I hope I hope that doesn't bother you. Okay. <sighs> okay, we're ready to shove shit on my face. I usually use my old foundation brush to apply my masks, but this one's a peel off. So I don't know if it's gonna ruin my brush. It's an old brush. It can handle it. Oh look, it's clear. That's weird. I figured it oh, I figured it would have been green. Oh, I'm really surprised it isn't green. I figured y'all would have been able to see something. <laughs> So uh, as I expected, uh, it is very, very sticky. It looks like glue, honestly, like clear glue. Ew. Oh, I gotta make sure not to get it on my eyebrows. I'm looking in my mirror over here, so sorry. This is a very delicate region. I'm gonna make sure not to get it on my eyebrows or my baby hairs. Peel-off masks make me nervous. Am I the only one? <laughs> like, I don't like, I'm a fan of clay masks, mud masks, you know what I mean? I have a shit ton of clay masks. <laughs> I have this one mask, it's a peel-off mask, but it's in a spray bottle. And you're supposed to spray it all over your face, let it sit for 10 minutes, and then you just peel it off. It is so strange to me, because it's a spray. So, I don't know, I've never tried it before because I've always been kind of nervous. Because you spray in a peel-off mask, it's gonna get in your hair, gonna get in your eyebrows it's I think that is good look 
I'm gonna go wash this brush before it gets ruined. <laughs> so, so far, first impressions, I really like it. It's extremely cooling. The cucumber is a very, very nice smell for this mask. It's very sticky. And that's pretty much all I have to say for right now. So, we're gonna wait for 10 minutes, see what happens, and... Okay, y'all, it is dry, and it is ready to go, and it itches like crazy around my nose. So, I'm gonna bring you in, and we're gonna take her off. Okay, you can see it's already starting to peel around my mouth, so... Okay, I heard you're supposed to peel up with masks, so I'm just going to tear it right in the middle there, and we're going to start peeling. Oh, no, 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 my baby hairs. Oh, under the eyes. I shouldn't have put it that close. Oh, I'm going to sneeze. I'm going to sneeze. Oh, my God, the itch is so good. Oh, I can't. Okay, I'm going to start peeling up on this side. Peach fuzz, my poor peach fuzz. Wow. <laughs> oh, my baby hairs. Man, she's off. Okay, y'all, this is it. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna show y'all this mask. It might be too dirty and gross. <laughs> wow, I just see a lot of peach fuzz that came off. Okay, y'all, that was it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. As far as that mask goes, I really like it, and I think I'm gonna be using a lot more of it here in the future because I, I love how soft my skin feels right now. Usually my skin only feels this soft if, like, I've just gotten done exfoliating the shit out of it. This is so good. I definitely recommend this mask for my drag girls out there. Oh, for everybody, but for my drag girls especially because it just feels so good. My nose is usually really like rough and dry and this is where I get a lot of my dry patches and up through here and between my eyebrows and it just feels so good and so soft. I definitely recommend this mask for sure and it's only $7. Like, you can't go wrong with seven dollars and it's a big ass tube that was it you guys i really hope you enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to give me a thumbs up down below and subscribe if you want to and i'll see y'all in my next video thank you bye bye